How's it going, guys? I am Arjuna TV, and um, I have a very fun subject today. Uh, a lot of you teenagers, you young kids, <laughs> are going to be interested in this. Um, and it is sex and dirty talking and stuff like that. So, my idea of being intimate with somebody is that it shares the definition of intimacy. Um, sex and sexual relations have lost their meaning over the years and I think that's really affected today's generation because everybody is so sexually orientated not in the sense of being gay or you know like everybody wants sex that's cool that is completely natural but um the the things we do to get that are pretty crazy I remember I read a story one one time somebody went to church and pretended to be Catholic and he went through the whole baptism and he got like he he supposedly loved God for the sake of the, there there was a girl there who he wanted to get in bed with. He got in bed with her. They were supposedly going out for like a week, and then he quit everything. And this is something that's really annoying because I think um, sex and the 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 ability to to be intimate with somebody should be saved not for when you're married. That's that's a long in my opinion. Uh, giggity. Um, I think that it should be safe for somebody who you want to be intimate with, who you can be romantic with, who you can share emotions. Because your body is something that, you know, you're brought up realizing you shouldn't walk around with your dick hanging out. Um, so you want to save that somebody who you feel you can trust rather than somebody you meet in a club. It's my opinion. I'm not saying that right. I'm not saying that my way is the way forward. Nobody will ever have sex again. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that sex used to mean something a lot more than what it does now. And I think it should still stand for that. Um, I was speaking to a friend the other day and he just ruined a friendship because he um, continuously was, was flirting and everything else all for the sake of like a dirty picture or something. And th his friend just said he, they'd had enough. So that was it. Um, and it, it's a shame. I mean, don't get me wrong. I, I flirt myself, but I don't mean it in a way like, okay, let me get in your pants. I mean it in a way like, um, they're just, just, it's part of my humor. I wouldn't act on, you know, my, my sexual needs or anything else unless I wanted to be romantically involved with that person. Um, that's just my opinion. I'm not saying I'm right. I'm not saying I'm wrong, but I hope you guys have understood that. And, um, I'm going to wrap the video up here because I'm just droning on and I haven't added like jump cuts or anything in this video because my uh, iMovie on uh, the iPhone 4S, which is what I use to edit my videos at the moment, is not working that well. So I'm just kind of going and trying to keep you guys interested. But thank you for the, the love on the video recently, guys. I mean, we've got four subscribers, which doesn't seem like a lot. But um, for me, that is a ma is is. What the fuck? You know, it's, it's crazy. So, ow, thank you so much for watching the video. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you, let me know what you uh, thought about the video and my opinions and uh, leave your opinions. Obviously, uh, we can have a debate and we can start a war. Uh, like the video because I'm keeping up with my vlog a day. I am happy that I'm doing that. I am really happy because I've never stuck with anything in my life, ever. So, thank you for watching the video. You're awesome. You're amazing. Subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, it's actually down there now. I love you. You're beautiful. I will see you in the next video. That was so bait. The way my finger just went stop like <laughs>